My dear students, today I would like to discuss a very amazing and easy shortcut method for solving multiple pulley cases. Actually, uh, many of the students will suffer a lot to solve the problems of multiple pulleys. But I will tell you in such a way that you will try to get attracted towards the method of solving the problems. So let us see here now. If you observe, this is a multiple pulley case. There is one shortcut here. What is that? The shortcut is... Tension is inversely proportional to acceleration. You remember this shortcut here. So with this it is key, it is clear that tension into acceleration is going to be constant here. Okay. So here you can consider tension T1 A1 is equal to T2 A2. So here this side in anti-clockwise direction and this side is a clockwise direction. You take anti-clockwise direction if you observe you will consider that 4t, 2t and t combined together it is going to be 7t into acceleration is a1 here and towards uh, clockwise direction if you observe you are going to see only t here and acceleration is a2 so t into a2 here that's it with this no need of any free body diagram no need of any uh, multiple equations for writing for the length of the strings and so on so you'll enjoy a lot this is a very amazing short trick so you can just cancel out tension and tension uh, with this it is clear that 7a1 is equal to a2 here so with this c option is going to be your correct answer thank you very